Hey, it's good to see you. Today we are back in Dollar General and we are going to work on the dollar aisle a little bit. It's actually not that bad at the moment. I mean, but sometimes it looks like it's not bad, but it's deceptively bad. It may look okay. Farm stand apple. These are pretty containers. Here, just do two rows of that. Why is that upside down? <laughs> I don't think this is actually supposed to be over here, but we'll leave it because I, I don't know. Okay, and then we have Bath and Beauty. Totally not copying Bath and Body Works. Totally. Apple Pumpkin Hand Soap. I bet that smells nice. Um, we have two rows of that. And Nighttime Sleep Aid. All this is is um, diphenhydramine. This is like Tylenol Simply Sleep, which has no Tylenol in it, so it's kind of um, confusing. It's, uh, it's Tylenol, but it's not Tylenol. It's made by Tylenol, but it has no acetaminophen in it. It's only diphenhydramine. This is actually a really good deal. This is the same as generic Benadryl. You get 100 caplets of diphenhydramine uh, for a dollar. It's That's the best deal I have ever seen for diphenhydramine, which a lot of people use for allergies. Um, it's actually a really good antihistamine. The only problem is it makes most people sleepy. Some people are lucky and it doesn't make them sleepy, but most people it does. My grandmother could take this and it didn't make her sleepy at all. She always had trouble with seasonal allergies and she would always take her Benadryl every day. She could take it in the middle of the day and be fine. I was so jealous. I can't do that. It makes me very sleepy. Look at these pretty scouring pads. This is so festive. You get 10 of them for a dollar. Look at all those nice colors. Or you can get these little mesh sponges. They're mesh covered net sponges. Little thingies there. Little, like two little scrubbing buddies. True little drunk scrubbing buddies. Stand up. There. And then we have nail files from Diamond. This is a value pack. You get, um, gosh, you get quite a few in here. One, or maybe they're just really thick. Maybe you just get three in there. That's still not bad for a dollar. They're pretty. It's kind of hard to work with these. Oh, you can also get Barbie Detangler. This is like the Johnson & Johnson No More Tears stuff. Um, oh, it's cotton candy scented. And it's only a dollar. Yeah, my mom used to buy the Johnson & Johnson for me. I always had tangles in my hair because I didn't I didn't keep up with it like I should have she kept threatening me if I didn't take better care of it she was gonna cut it all off and I didn't believe her and she actually did so I had short hair for a while when I was eight I only remember I was eight because that was the summer I broke both of my arms and I, I had a cast on my arm all summer because exactly one week after getting the cast off one arm, I broke the other arm. Oh, and I dislocated my wrist both times, too. Yeah, a lot of fun. Here's a body wash pen. I've never seen anything like that. Huh. I wonder if this was part of something else. Like it should be in something. I don't know. We have band-aids here. These are assorted band-aids. Oh, here's some of this knockoff um, stuff. This is knockoff Dracar. It's called Jet Black, Our Expression of Dracar Noir. Revel for Men. They have all these knockoffs down here. Like you have, what is this one? Infatuation, that's like obsession. These get broken into a lot. And this is like um, cool water. It's called Riptide. That sounds violent. Jordash 72. They give these numbers for some reason. That doesn't sound very intriguing to me. Here's another one that's been... Oh, it's upside down. 
Let me um, let me fix that right quick. Well, I fixed it the best I could. I'm gonna have a video coming to you later today about the COPPA changes to YouTube that are coming in January. Um, it's going to affect all YouTubers and it's going to affect some stuff on my channel as well. Um, I've made some decisions about how to handle it to avoid that $42,000 fine per video. Yeah, I don't know if you're aware of the COPPA stuff. It's going to drastically impact. I mean, if it goes through the way they say it is, it's going to drastically impact YouTube from here on out. So, I'm going to be making some changes. I'll let y'all know about it later. Later today, as soon as I can get to it. But right now, let's not worry about it. What is this? Hey, Clorox made a hand soap. That sounds awful. I feel like using sandpaper as a lotion. Clorox Fragancia hand soap? Lavender with eucalyptus. I don't know, something about Clorox being in the name just makes it sound awful. In great sense, non-aerosol air care, sweet blossom and pear. And then we have these icy bath bot oh no no, three in one hair and body. Shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. And it smells like an icy. This must be an older bottle. Because these new ones are all red. We'll put that one in the front so maybe it'll sell. Rotating the stock responsibly. There. Oh, and they have Paw Patrol 2-in-1 shampoo plus conditioner. I'm looking to see if it's anywhere else. I try to put stuff together that goes together. Here's one of those bath bombs. They had a bunch of these before. Here is some kids, three in one. Oh, they have Warhead shampoo. <laughs> I've never seen that. This has been here for a while. Ocean Breeze. I always thought these containers looked like shampoo bottles from the 80s with all the pink and the teal and the palm trees and whatnot. Looks like the opening scene of a Miami Vice episode or something. Let's put the uh, kid stuff up there. Here's a Dollar General body wash, fresh mist. Um, and there's a lilac. Oh, wait, wait. Here's the warheads down here. Well, there's a bunch of it, and I want to keep it together. And Soft Whisper, Mystical Wonderland. Gotta love that Soft Whisper. This is a moisturizing body wash with aloe. 15, I'm sorry, 18 ounces of Soft Whisper. Oh, and we also have Soft Whisper Wicked Cherry Blossom and Sun. There's radiation in here. Hey, here's a new thing. BioExpert Pro One. Revitalizing and control infused with natural botanical oils. So what is it? Is it a shampoo? Is it a conditioner? Is it a lotion? Oh, it's shampoo. Well, it doesn't say it's shampoo anywhere on the front. Oh, and we also have red berry and cedar hand soap. From, again, from Bath & Beauty. Then we have a Bath and Beauty. Oh, we have the Apple Pumpkin, but it's way up there. I'm not really inclined to move it all. I'm gonna leave it where it is because I figure they have a reason for the way they do stuff. Let's see here. Okay, it's all right. And agree, this stuff's been around forever. Spa soap, liquid hand soap, milk and honey. And here we have Lilac Breeze. Let's put that right here. We also have a moisturizing hand wash from Ashley Bell. Lord, this thing's huge. Fresh cut lemon, 25 ounces for only a dollar. All right, there's the Warheads. I have this big thing in my way.
Um, little packs of antibacterial hand wipes. There's really no good way to put these here. Oh, there's some more soft whisper. We can cherry and blossom and sun. Let's move this down here. I just like to keep them together. It's only two. I just set them there. Okay. <laughs> Antibacterial hand wipes. I wish I had a box or something to hold that up. And, ooh, that's disgusting. <laughs> Triple shine, triple botulism, more like it. I'm gonna leave it there because I don't, that's gross though. And a one run, a lone roll of Scott bath tissue. It looks like it's already been used. True blue for women. Oh, it's like a light blue. It's a little hand cream. Okay, I'll leave it there. It's made by that Revel company. And here we have a sheet mask from Spa Stations. They're the ones who make that Himalayan salt body wash that I like so much. I think. No, I may be wrong about that. We'll just stick it right here with the rest. And we also have a Super Mario bath bomb. Okay. Just do that. And we have Color Stay Bold Black Moisturizing Shampoo. Protects color and provides shine. Nice. Here's another um, allergy relief. This is also diphenhydramine, um, but it's by a different company. You only get 20 self soft gels. I don't really know where to put that. Um, I would like to have all the OTC stuff together, but. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to make that big of a drastic change in here. I'm just trying to straighten stuff as much as possible. Here we have from Dental Guru, a charcoal white toothpaste with peppermint. Hmm. I'm going to start calling my dentist that. I'm going to tell her she's the dental guru. <laughs> She'd probably like that. Okay. And we have nasal decongestant, P.E., PE used to stand for pseudoephedrine, but since they can't sell that over the counter anymore, they have that dreaded phenylephrine in there. It's absolutely useless. Trust me, if you live in the United States, just go to a drugstore and go back to the pharmacy counter and get, get pseudoephedrine. Do not waste your time with phenylephrine because it's awful. Pseudoephedrine is the real deal. That's the good stuff. Here we have a little thing of white rain. Y'all remember white rain hairspray back in the 80s? Oh my goodness. I went through so many cans of that. I didn't have huge hair in the 80s, but you know, I have very fine hair, so I made it as big as I could. Goo Gone. This is the cutest little bottle of Goo Gone I've ever seen. This stuff is wonderful. I have a, a spray bottle of it at home. And it's really great for removing um, goo and adhesives like sticker residue on a mirror or whatever. Spray a little bit on there and it just wipes right off. We have another odor eliminator. What if, um, what if we put, no, what if we put these odor eliminators together like that? That's good. An oil of life. This is like, well, they just call it Olay now. It used to be called oil of Olay. Like that. And we have Salon Selective's Instant Repair Leave-In Conditioner. I bought some of this and tried it. It was okay, but... Here's a cute little thing of Garnier Fruit Teas. I don't know what to do with you, sweetheart. And we have some extra... Laundry detergent. Eleven loads for a dollar. Oh, here are those uh, double-edged razor blades. They had a bunch of these. I don't see them now. I'll stick them up here somewhere. That is. Oh. 
they don't stand up. You just have to leave them like that. Then we have Mucus Relief PM. What is this? Oh, I think that's supposed to be hanging up. Oh, I think it goes up there, but I can't reach it. <laughs> I need a ladder. All right. Immediate release. That's unfortunate. That just ruined your date night. This is um, dextromethorphan, 20 milligrams and 400 milligrams of guaifenesin. Dextromethorphan is a cough suppressant. Guaifenesin is an expectorant to loosen the stuff in your chest. We also have low-dose aspirin here. That's going to be 81 milligrams. That's the low-dose of aspirin. This is from Right Remedies. You get a hundred of these tablets for only a dollar. And we have Smart Care Ultra Soft Tissue. And here you can get a whole manicure set for only a dollar. You get emery boards, two pairs of fingernail clippers, tweezers, and little uh, manicure sticks. That would be a nice little stocking stuffer for somebody. Okay, let's see what we have down here. We even have an aroma guru. So you have your dental guru and a roll-on aroma guru. Aromatherapy. And it looks like they're all lavender flavored. I don't know what this smells like, but I don't normally like lavender stuff. These make a lot of noise when you pull them out of there. I don't... Oh, this doesn't go over here at all. This is not a dollar. We'll set it in purgatory. Oh, wait. There's the white rain. Here. That's white rain right there. And we have Inspire Premium Pro Vitamin Hydrating Conditioner. Mod, Mod Modest Basics. This is an all-over body wash and lavender chamomile flavor. We even have Frozen Conditioning Shampoo. This is only a dollar. That's pretty great. Look at these happy little... <laughs> I want one of these in my shower. This is a vanilla ice cream scented body wash, shampoo, and conditioner. That is so adorable. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> uh, I'm going to miss being able to just make videos and not worry about a $42,000 fine. It's so sad. Some airhead sanitizers. Lord, we got a mess down here. I think this traumatized bottle was here when we were here last time. Like it... Well, it stands up, but the odds of it getting sold are pretty low. Alright, Modess, what are we going to do with you? I think we're going to do two rows of you. I think we're going to have to. What is back? some deodorant. What are you doing back there, you little shy thing? Here's another vanilla ice cream scented thingy. Nasal decongestant. Those odious things go up here. You. I'm gonna leave you there. We have some bowls. I don't know if they go here or not. Um, we have bath soaks, rose petal flavor. Put them down here with these bath bombs. These are warheads, green apple bath bombs. And there's an airheads bath bomb.
you, you poor thing. Bless your heart. Here we have icy bath bombs. They don't stand up worth a darn. That's just what they want. Hmm. Let me work on these a minute. It's going to get loud. Okay, I had a talk with them and they understood that they needed to stand up. I had to kind of straighten out the base a little bit. They're going to cooperate now. Oh, whoops, there's another one. I didn't see that one. <laughs> you just stand there. All right, and we have some baby wipes. Now, these are from Baby Touch. Oh, Lord, there's more. There. And these are Parade. Par parade. I don't know. Conditioner. They don't have any of the shampoo. Here's one of these kids thingies again. Watermelon Blast Flavor. And a post-workout Epsom Recovery Soak. You can live right there. Now, I know these aren't in any particular order, but um, I don't want to change the order of stuff too much. Here we have allergy relief. Now this is fexofenadine. That is generic Allegra. You can also get Allegra with uh, phenyl, um, pseudoephedrine, but you have to go to a pharmacy counter to get it. Now this is a non-drowsy antihistamine, 180 milligrams. You're gonna get three doses in here for a dollar. Although I found the cheapest way to get stuff like that is to go somewhere like Costco. I get my generic Zyrtec at Costco. It's a lot cheaper. And on one of these things. I can get a whole year's supply of um, generic Zyrtec at Costco for around $15. And it's a bottle of 365 tablets. I mean, it's awesome. It'll do me the whole year. You're $2. You don't go here either. Oh, wait, that can go up here, actually. Oh, look what I did. Done, done it now. <laughs> okay. Now, again, I know it's all mixed up, but look. Look at everything. Oh, my goodness. We made it look better. I think we did. I think it looks better. It's better than it was. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. I'm really fascinated by this right here. This is, that is just too cute. I want one. <laughs> so thank you so much for hanging out with me. And we made it look really nice. I hope you have a great day. And I will see you again really soon.